Yeah. Maybe it'd be better if I just quit. The club would probably be fine without me. Besides, I... I don't think I'm cut out to be an artist. What? How long have you been here? Did you hear everything? <laughs> so you did hear everything then. My dad told me to quit the art club. He said I need to study more and concentrate on my future. When I told him I was a finalist in the contest, I thought he'd be proud. But all he said was that I was wasting my time. He said it's my responsibility to take over the hospital because I'm his only son. My dad doesn't care about me. He only cares about his stupid hospital. And it's not just him either. Just because my dad's a doctor, everyone expects me to be one too. I have my own dreams too, you know. I can't stand it anymore. You're right. I have to tell my dad how I feel. Yeah, you're on to something. I figured it out. I'm going to make a bet with my dad. If I don't win the contest, then I'll quit the club just like he wants me to. But if I win, then I can do whatever I want. And as soon as I get home, I'm going to convince him. Do you mind keeping this under wraps? I don't want anyone worrying that I might quit the art club. So let's just keep this between us, okay? Hey, would you mind letting the art club know that I'll be taking the day off? I want to have the talk with my dad today. Well, see you later.
that's how it's done. So... Conditioning in here too high. I feel a little lightheaded. I haven't been feeling well lately. I couldn't even finish my lunch today. I think I may have caught a cold. I'm sorry, but do you think we could go to the pharmacy? I'm going to go get some medicine. I'll be right back. On your way home from school? Huh? Well, well, what do you want? Wow, you're really cute. From this angle, I can see how gorgeous you are in those glasses. Say, you want to maybe sit down at a cafe and chat a little? Um, I... Hey, come on, don't be scared. I'm not gonna fight. No, please stop. Who the hell are you? Wait, don't tell me that you're with her. <laughs> no, I thought I had a chance since she looked so plain. Oh, thank goodness. I thought you were going to hit him for a second. I wouldn't want you to get into a fight because of me. But just now, you are so... Um... <sighs> You've already saved me, so I'm not scared anymore, but why am I still shaking? That does make me feel a lot better. Okay. Thank you. I think I'm fine now.
Looking forward to it. I shall be waiting then. A shame. Very well then. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Goodbye now. done for today. Could we go somewhere to eat after this? Merci. That means a lot to me. There is something I need to talk to you about. Hello. Where do I begin? I'm afraid I might have to go back home soon. The only reason I was able to come here was because of my aunt. But my uncle did not agree with the decision. Get home now, maintenant. Is he my uncle or the mafia? If I do return home, back to my uncle, I might never come back to Japan again. Please, no. Japan is where I want to be. I want to learn everything about it. Except, it does not matter what I say to him. I cannot afford to live here without my uncle's help. And I have gotten to know you well. I cannot simply say, see you later, and leave you like this.
It's almost time to say, see you later. Then I'll see you at the club sometime.
lightning round. Day. I've been waiting for you. Oh, my. A shame. Very well, then. Good day. Here are my requests. The world you live in is so bright and colorful. Very well, then. here at this hour. This time of day is perfect. So, um, there is something I needed to ask you. <sighs> Thank you. So, there's this friend I have. Um, she's a girl. And, well, there's a boy who's been helping her a lot recently. Like giving advice on her problems, looking over her homework, that kind of thing. She even told me that lately, she can't stop thinking about him. So I, I was wondering, is she in love right now? Senpai. <sighs> now that I'm hearing you say it, I get the feeling you're right. Or at least, I hope you are. I mean, I'm sure that's how my, um, friend feels. Thank you. With your help, I think I know how I should proceed now. I, I mean, I know what to tell my friend now. about such a weird topic. Senpai, you always take my problems so seriously. You're too nice. Well, should we get going? Oh, that reminds me. I think I'm slowly starting to get over my fear of men. So far, I can only talk to boys I know, but I can almost look them in the eye. But with you, I, I think I can do even better. As long as it's nothing too scary, go ahead. Oh, your hand. 
rugged, strong, warm. <sighs> it, it's almost like we're a couple. I'm so sorry. I can't believe I said something so inappropriate. Uh, um, uh, should we get going? From looking at a single jab, you can tell how different everything is at the top level. And not only are both fighters strong, they each have their own unique fighting style. What kind of fighter is your favorite? I get that. The essence of boxing is to land hits without getting hit yourself. I tend to rely on footwork in my matches too. But someday, I'm hoping to master the style of infighting. Now that I'm watching these again, I can see there's a lot to learn from professional matches. Plus, when I do it here, I have someone to discuss things with. Let's do this again next time you're free. those guys fighting is making it hard for me to sit still. You want to head to my room and wail in the punching bag for a bit? Oh, good morning. 
Once I had a melon pond, then a katsu sandwich. Then an agave pond, a kane pond, a yakisoba pond, apple strudel, another agave pond. But I gotta have my rice, too. Mm. I... I think that might have been... too many carbs. Today, a girl in my class asked me, Who's that cute guy you went to Umiyushi with? She wanted me to introduce you two so you could eat lunch together. Without me. Girls always go for guys like you. Or my little brother. I guess looks really are everything. But once we're dead, we'll all just be bones. You can't tell a handsome skeleton from an ugly one. Uh, not again! Why do my memories make me so damn hungry? Hey, waiter! Another tonkatsu special! While we wait for the food, let me share a little Sinryu poem I wrote. He who cut you is no friend, but he who cuts you, you flavor until the end. Huh? Oh. Oh! My... my stomach! Emergency! That was way too close. If that toilet was just a bit further away... Oh, boy. No, I'm fine. No worries. Everything's good and normal over here. Except for my weight, that is. Ah! The Gourmet King shouldn't say things like that. I, I didn't mean to be so crass. I mean, who wants to talk about toilets while they're eating? Ah, I keep saying toilet! Sorry, sorry. Okay, enough of that. Let's shovel that food down. We have to eat every chance we get. Because once we're dead, all we'll be eating is dust. You know, just like my little brother. Yeah, for all. 